channel. Welcome back explorers. My name's Jack. You join me here today doing another Drumeo video. I am really enjoying these series, especially jazz drummers. Seeing how jazz drummers attempt rock songs is something very fun for me because I love seeing how musicians dissect songs, pick them apart and then put what they feel goes where. And that's always fun to see. So I'm not gonna pause too much unless something incredible happens. I'm a huge fan of Korn. Grew up on them. I think they were one of the first new metal bands I ever listened to. Yeah, definitely. Uh, Fieldy is one of the reasons I learned to play bass. I think the tone that he could get out of his chunky, chuggy slapping was incredible. Even to this day, I still really enjoy the band. Who doesn't? <laughs> if you're new around here and you like what you see, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, all of that good stuff. Come join the live streams Tuesday, Thursdays and Sundays. We do all of the good, fun things you can think of. Music, games, sports, the lot. If you're old around here, welcome back explorers, ready to delve into another Drumeo video. Oh, I'm especially Freak on a Leash, because this song is, if you've never heard it before, it is a very drum driven track. People think it's guitar driven, but it's not. It's so drum driven, it's insane. So, I'm intrigued. Sit back, relax, join me, won't you? Wow, the lyrics are so beautiful. The music video has 319 million views. <laughs> you know, to get to that level of expression, 333 it's million. Amazing. Ooh, yeah, man. A jazz I mean, drummer getting funky the with the doubles. <laughs> you know, going in. I feel embarrassed because it's such a great song. This is gonna be good. Wait, this is. All right, so this. This is only eight minutes long. So is this a true one? I'm not gonna pause it. I'm not gonna pause it. Let's go. <laughs> Here for the first time, right? Yeah, so have you, uh, have you seen any of these? Oh yeah, I've seen them. Which, uh, <laughs> which, <laughs> which one's your favorite? I'm not gonna say anything right now. We just gonna get through it. And then, and then we'll, we'll talk about it afterwards because I don't want you giving me no more sugar. <laughs> Uh, projects you, have you worked with? I played with the likes of Betty Carter, Michael Brecker, Wynton Marcellus, Bradford Marcellus, Terrence Blanchard. Oh Joe my Anderson. God, so this dude is like... So many legends. Jazz, I'm grateful jazz. to be in this space right now in time. We've got a bunch of options. Excuse my ignorance, if I don't you know, know who he is. Uh, the song that we give you, but just give me the thumbs up. I'm excited. And jump to the next one. You ready? Yeah, let's just go. Every day here at Drumio, we get tons of questions from students about how to improvise on the drums, and also how to play jazz. Is he on the just gonna free ball it straight from the first listen? Brand new chorus with Juilliard instructor <laughs> Ulysses Owens Jr. called 30 Day Jazz Drummer. There's gonna be daily guided workouts. Especially with now. There's gonna be weekly live streams. Especially where now. Questions answered. Considering that ad's so early and it's only month, an eight minute video. Is this on the kit, gentleman through some tunes and all that good stuff? Just gonna so go straight into, into the song without listening through it all. You can get enrolled for the course and all the details are there for you. He's just playing along. Ooh. Something takes a part of me. He's on the spot improvising. Lost and never seen. Every time I start to believe. Okay, we're finding a groove. I never knew I needed slow drums on Freak on a Leash before. <laughs> Not even gonna lie, the first few bars where he was just noodling to get the feel for it, instantly I was like, this guy is gonna find a pocket and he's found that pocket. I... <laughs> Ah, it just goes to show that it doesn't matter what genre of music you love if you apply yourself 
you can have so much, um, let's go. The first and final take. It's just, it's more, mm. Find it, find it. It's just those little triple kicks there, very nice. Again, it's just such a weird song if you don't know it. And he's just, he's not even listening to it once. I rate it so hard. Yeah, he's riding that, that bass rhythm. And the vocals. Those off tilt a little kicks are quite nice. What is he gonna do during a beatboxing? I know what I'm going to play after this. Go! Ah! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm having fun with the song as well now. Yeah, right, that heavy crash. Ooh, nice little kicks there. <laughs> He's just jamming out now. He's just having, because again, if this isn't something you play, whether you're not being perfect or not, he's having fun. <laughs> so? <laughs> Do you know that song? No. Drumio strikes again. <laughs> Drumio wins. Yeah, I'm with the good hits. What did you think of that song? It was fun. It was liberating in a certain way. Now, I'm a chart guy. So when the chart is there, then it's like I have an understanding of what the, mm -hmm. the tune is supposed to be. If you were like going to really dive in and, and like make a version of this song and like learn a part for it, would you want to kind of go through your process of charting this out? The things that, you know, he, they, she are thinking about is something that's very profound to who they are. Mm -hmm. I would have to get to know the tune and understand it for what it is, and that way we can capture that. Because right now, I'm just kind of playing me. And that's selfish, you know? But it's fun. Yeah. <laughs> I was just about to say, how is that selfish? Again, yeah. <laughs> that was your first attempt at a song you've never heard with no drums. That <laughs> You cannot be selfish. <laughs> but, you know. We're gonna play you the original. Have you ever heard of the band Korn? Yes, of course. Uh, the song is called Freak on a Leash. The music video has 319 million views. 333 million <laughs> as of the time of this. The drummer is David Silveria, and this came out in 1998. That nice little roll sound. Mm. 
The roll on the snare is so clean. That deep bass. Something lost and never seen. Every time I start to believe. Oh, this is so much fun. That chunky bass. Yes. Nice. Ah! <laughs> oh, the music video for this is incredible as well. Very revolutionary for the time. For a music yeah. video. It rips, man. Yeah, I mean, you know, that's what I was saying. It's like, my man was speaking from the, speaking from the heart, man. <laughs> you know, it was going in. Wow, the lyrics are so beautiful. And they are the weirdly. They interpreted the song. You know, to get to that level of expression is, it's amazing. The way the drummer just, you know, he kept it simple enough so that the lyrics of the words wouldn't get over, Gosh. yeah, so they wouldn't get overcrowded. I appreciate that. Thank yeah. you. I feel embarrassed because it's such a great song. <laughs> anyway, thank you, Dromeo. Thank you to, I didn't even remember this dude's name, Eric Harland. Why does that name sound familiar? I don't know. Oh, Dromeo strikes again. I have had a great time. If you have, leave a like, leave a comment. It lets YouTube know you're enjoying it. Let me know which Dromeo to do next. Go check the Dromeo series on my channel. Come join the live streams, all that good stuff. Have a great day. Be well and bye-bye.